Hey guys, SSR here again. So I was out here looking for some sheet metal, doing some projects here, and uh, come across something. Hope you guys might want to see it. Anybody see it? You see it right there? Anybody know what that is? You see it rattling its tail? Acting like a rattlesnake. Oh, he got me that time. Oops. So in some parts of the country, they call these gopher snakes. Uh, here in Oklahoma, it's called a king snake. Now, as you can see, he's quite aggressive. <laughs> And he looks like he would uh, really do some harm. Whoa, you see that? Look at there. Now I'm going to put my arm up here and let him. He's fast. Ooh, he's quick. Oh, look at there. He almost hit me. Oh, almost hit me again. Oh, he got me that time. Oops. See, he brought some blood. Wow. Yeah, he's uh, he's quite aggravated. But anyway, he's just a little king snake. They call him here. Um, no harm. They won't hurt you. And they only take a few minutes to calm down. And I'll show you this. This is how I do them. I usually get their head in between my legs like that, and slowly but surely you work your way up to their head <laughs> he's getting there <laughs> oh he's still wanting to bite you know, he's pretty feisty let's see come on feller they're really not that mean though <clears throat> Come on now, calm down, calm down. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Okay, so now I got his head and he can see that I'm not gonna hurt him. And he's all right. Now he could still bite me, but most likely he won't. But you see there's no diamond on the head. Diamond uh, de uh, depicts uh, venomous usually although they can flare a little bit but there is no diamond so this is your average king snake gopher snake um, whatever but they're no big deal they're actually good they eat venomous snakes believe it or not so anyway we've seen that dead one earlier today and I showed you that one and I thought I'd show you this one so like I said they're they take a few minutes to calm down but after they calm down see his head's loose now and he may strike at me again now that his head's loose because he's got some distance there that he could but all I do is bring him closer to my body and then he has no reason to strike so Anyway, I just thought I'd show you guys this. I've been handling snakes my whole life. Venomous, um, rattlesnakes, Mojave greens. So, I'm kind of used to it. But, uh, anyway, we don't have to kill them all. Some of them are actually good for the environment. They get rid of the rats and mice. And if we didn't have them, we'd be overrun rodents. So, anyway, I thought I'd show you guys this. Hey, y'all have a good day. So now we're going to let him go. Let him go back to doing whatever snakes do. Just put him down there. He should take off. Yep, he come up off my arm. And now he's gone. So he'll go get some mice and rats that uh, probably uh, tearing stuff up. Anyway. 
that's all on that one.